Uh, I'm a romantic, and I would always give women flowers if they liked it or not. One flower uh, type I would never get are pansies, because pansies are the weakest flowers. <laughs> Thank you. I go with roses usually. Rough on the outside, sweet on the inside. Just like my women preference. <laughs> every uh, every time I pick up a rose for Stacy, the rose arose to the occasion and she loved it. <laughs> Stacy was a good girlfriend, but she uh, would always barge into my house like Kramer from Seinfeld. Like... <laughs> <laughs> I would always tell her, does a doorbell ring a bell? <laughs> uh, another problem with Stacy was her family were a bunch of criminals. Like, their version of a handshake was chopping someone's hands off and just putting them in a the blender and eating them. That totally never happened, guys. <laughs> Stacy was too sweet. She was too innocent in all this. Stacy had a, a brother named Mason who uh, wanted to be a Mason, but instead sold cocaine. But he says he still gets to move bricks around. <laughs> hey. Mason actually gave someone the death stare for trying to short him on his payment, and he ended up dropping dead right on the spot. Now, I don't know if his death stare causes actual death, but... On that day, I was not gonna let him stare at me for longer than five seconds, just to make sure. <laughs> I mean, I did everything to try to get the family to like me. Mason and his family needed a, a new nickname for cocaine. Uh, other than Blow, I was thinking... <laughs> I was thinking... Uh, how about... You know, people sniff the cocaine instead of blowing it, so why not call it sniff? <laughs> so uh, I had some street cred after that. But uh, I lost my phone once. Uh, we, the family, and I went to Las Vegas to gamble. Being a criminal, you know, you had so many burner phones with you, so I was given one of theirs. I didn't want this thing for long, but didn't want to tell the squad, so I ended up uh, throwing the phone away in the in the water drain the next moment I had a loan and I got the same brand of phone so <laughs> no one knew that I got rid of the original <laughs> I, I ain't getting tracked by the FBI well not more than they actually track us already I definitely took a gamble in Vegas of getting caught with an old phone used by a criminal <laughs> <laughs> I followed the law as much as I could being around her family, but the family was planning a heist for this bank in Texas here in Mexico. Look, I'm not proud of this, but I actually suggested to them a plan to get away with it. I don't know why I was trying to impress them so much. <laughs> Stacy never even went on the trips. She was an angel, but my plan was if I robbed the bank and gave away a good chunk of the charity, a good chunk of the money to charity, they'll look like the bad guys when they take it away from them. <laughs> yeah, loopholes. But they, uh, they assured me that uh, Stacy's mom has got it going on already with the original plan. <laughs> Stacy's mom is has got it going on. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, that was the last day I uh, hung with her family because Stacy's uh, family and her moved to Mexico. And yeah, I, I ain't going to Mexico, man. Yeah, there's good cities in Mexico, but uh, yeah, I'm just not doing it. Thanks for listening. I won't quit my day job. Yay!